Welcome back to the channel. Quick little video today about self-improvement and really the main problem with self-improvement and the self-improvement niche. I myself am a content creator in that space. I really do value fitness, uh, getting your resources up, so progressing in a career or starting your own business and being like, just basically being the best version of yourself. So I am in the self-improvement niche as a creator. My name's Dylan. I've been making content on YouTube now for almost two years and I'm just getting consistent. But the biggest problem with self-improvement I've noticed nowadays is that it creates introverted weird men. If you're like too much into self-improvement, you literally become a guy who can't even have a conversation with people anymore. You're too focused on grinding all the time. You're too focused on things need to be this way, that way. You're basically like a alpha red pill type of loser almost, in my opinion. So. I really do believe in self-improvement. I believe in being the best version of yourself. I believe you need to be fit. You need to take care of your health. You need to have the ability to have resources, which in our case is money to support yourself and support the people you care about. You need to have a skill set that makes you valuable in the world. But I'm making this video because last night I took my clients out, downed like 20 shots that night. Is that cinematic one? Is <laughs> And some people won't have that kind of fun. They won't party. They won't have fun because self-improvement tells them not to. You shouldn't be going out. You should stay in. You shouldn't have friends. You shouldn't talk to people that are below you. They're not waking up at 5 a.m. every day. So that's really the main rant and the point of this video. Subscribe if you agree with me. Comment below if you don't. But that's my personal take on the dangers of self-improvement. If you dive into it too much, you become this robot who can't even enjoy life really. And, and one of the big things I stress or I believe in that me and my friends used to talk about is you gotta have these pillars. You gotta have your financial pillars in check. You gotta have your health pillars in check. And health includes taking care of how you look, your, your facial features, your skincare, your fitness, your physique, the clothes you wear. And I'm gonna talk and I'm not talking about expensive clothing either. And then the third one is, are you social? Can you have conversations with people? Can you go up and talk to that girl without making it awkward? A lot of red pill guys can't. They're like, oh, this girl wants to just, I don't even know what the red pill community is, so I'm not, let me not paraphrase it, but a lot of people dive into this niche too hard and, and they get lost in the sauce and you can really be successful, have a really happy life and better yourself without being that weird guy. So. Keep grinding, be the best version of yourself. We'll see you in tomorrow's video. Quick little video, cause it's Stampede where I am right now and there's a lot of partying going on, a lot of enjoyment. So they're probably gonna be mo mostly rants. Check out my daily short form, kind of the same thoughts that go into that video, but it's daily, no edits, no nothing. Stay tuned for tomorrow's video.